plein air painting has been been around for a hundred years. It goes back to say the Heidelberg School and people like that um, who went out and painted what they saw. So plein air actually means painting, it's French for painting on location and that's exactly what we do. We find something that we're interested in, like the river at the moment, we're painting along the river, painting the big old gums, uh, the paddle steamers at Ichuga, painting what we see, bringing the story across. It's a beautiful place, let's look after it. Plain air is you're out there amongst it and you're seeing the light and shade and and the atmosphere and colour that a photograph just doesn't capture. You know, like the human eye sees in nature uh, much more than uh, what you what you, you see in a photograph. Is this a good place to paint? I gather it must be. Oh, the, the boys were just blown away. They'd never seen paddle steamers before. Well, they'd seen photos, of course, but they'd never seen them steaming up and all the things that were happening at Ichuka. So uh, they, there's just about half a dozen mouths on the bank there, wide open, saying, wow. Mm. <laughs> so, uh, and then, so we painted there for a couple of days and people came down and watched. It was excellent, yes. The effect of light is the thing I like. Uh, on, uh, could be the you know, effect of light, the way it falls around a beautiful old gum tree. It uh, gives you the contrasts and uh, that uh, dramatic effect. Or as today here on the river, it's a bit more softer and subdued because there's a little bit of cloud about, so it's got a softness to it. So light, um, light is everything when it comes to painting. <laughs>